this hair guys i mean look at these curls um it did come pre-plucked but i also customized it off camera and bleached my knots i am starting with freshly washed hair and i'm going to be braiding my hair for under my wig and i do like my braids kind of small um they last longer in my preference but you can have your your juicy braids your dookie braids however you want to call them but um small braids are just my go-to because it does help my installs last longer all right now we're all braided please do not forget to moisturize and oil your scalp guys like that is key that is key that is key you may call me regular diggler but i do not do any meltdown fake scalp thing all i do is put a cap on just to keep my braid secure and i go from there I use Gots to be in the black tube on my edges and like that little area of my forehead where some of my wig will lay. Not only do I use it to um, get my baby hairs out the way, it also serves as like that first layer, that that first, ugh. <laughs> I mean, y'all get what I'm trying to say. I use it to lay down my wigs, basically, y'all. I've never used glue or anything else. All I use is Gots to be and my freeze spray where you will see how i use the freeze spray later on once the wig has kind of settled in a little bit i do go in and pull out my edges which i will be using for baby hairs and that space that you see after i pull out my baby hairs i apply my freeze spray and it just helps to give me more of a melted secure install i did cut most of my lace off camera and when I'm cutting my lace, I do brush back those baby hairs that I pulled out. I comb them back and from here, I'm able to see what leftover lace that I need to cut off. So that's just what I'm doing here. As you can see, I just have some parts that I need to just, you know, snip off. Do not cut in straight lines. I did do like a zigzag. Um, and honestly, I could have kept that little extra lace because I could have simply used Gossipy Be Free spray on it and it would have melted down. But the less lace in most cases helps to give you more of a finished look and to make it look more natural. I could have done no baby hair and one day I think I may try that. But for this video, I am going to be um, laying down my baby hairs. So I normally do have harsh baby hairs, you know, lay straight to the scalp. And I'm trying to evolve and get better with doing my own hair. So in this video, I'm actually going to be brushing out my baby hairs and giving them that soft, natural look. And I'm never going back to harsh baby hairs, y'all. After this video, I was just like, wow. So here you see me just combing out my baby hairs. I did use um, some foaming mousse and my Gots to be gel um, before I combed them out. And you're just gonna see me here just trimming them to my liking, just relaying them with some mousse because the mousse does not make them harsh. Um, and yeah, showing you guys some of the parting space and trying to figure out am I going to do a side part or a middle part. I honestly prefer <laughs> side parts. Um, I just feel like middle parts don't do me justice, but what do you guys think? Which do you prefer? Do you like a nice crisp side part or a center sleek middle part? Can we get into this scalp? Can we get into this lace? Yes, I'm so pleased with how I laid this wig, y'all. 